I get a lot of comments and people asking about how to diagnose a misfire. Uh, one of the key things to diagnosing a misfire is to do a Noid light test on a fuel injected car. This is a Noid light, it's for uh, a GM port fuel injection or GM PFI. And so basically what you do with this is you unplug the injector. This is a Chrysler Pacifica 3.5 liter 2006. You look at the plug and this just plugs in there so you got a positive and a ground. Uh, go ahead and crank it over Tyson. Okay, hold on. I didn't get it in there good apparently. Stuck it in the wrong hole. It didn't even fuss. Alright, go ahead. Alright, that's good. So what we saw there is we saw bright flashes at first for starting you get more fuel and then after that a, a quick pulse or a short pulse. This is an incandescent bulb in it, um, you know just tungsten filament. So what it does is it kind of gives you an idea of what your pulse is like. If it's a long pulse, short pulse, and uh, if it's real dim or not. So we know that it's getting signal and we had a code P0206 which means that we have an open circuit on cylinder 6 injector. So it's not the car's issue, it's not, from the wire harness we're fine. So if it's not this, uh, then we know that the injector's bad. So we're going to be replacing the fuel injector on this little hummajuma for my sister. So anyway, that's how you perform a Noid light test to see if you have injector pulse. Um, you know, as far as the individual injector goes, there's things that you can do. You can use a stethoscope. Um, with a needle on it instead of a pad for listening to your heart so I do hope this video was helpful to you you know as far as diagnosing a misfire the other things to check for are compression and ignition it's usually ignition by the way but you check your ignition wire spark plug wires basically same thing um, check your spark plug and see if it's got a cracked porcelain or something like that so anyway that's how you do an injector uh, noid light test Thanks for watching. Be sure to click like, comment, subscribe, and uh, thanks for watching.